Hello everyone, and uh, welcome back to part 16 of the Atano Clan campaign for Total War Shogun 2. In the last episode, we continued to capture some more territory, and we're now literally right next door to Kyoto. Hopefully, I'm going to see about taking that out this episode, and we'll have the first Christian Damio. In the meantime, we have to deal with this. Now, we've got one Nightman trade ship against how many ships? Eight of them, including two heavy boons, medium boon, it's a Gukuku boon and a couple of firebomb ones and that so I want to try and save the ship I want to try and wipe them out as well so we are going to fight this battle I know you guys might not consider the sort of ship battles the best part of this compared to the land and I have to agree but I do want to try and wipe these ones out so you know it's a situation like that where my you know Navan trade ship is on the defensive and it will lose. I have no choice but really to fight it out. So, sorry for this guys. I do love this particular background though. You know, all the different things. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I'm also a psychology graduate. I am part of a couple of my lessons. We're looking at Eastern, different between cultures. And there's a reason why you see a lot of Oriental, not just Japanese, but also to Chinese, Korean styles, all wave like this. Is because they're very interdependent. They enjoy looking at, they've got a focus on the community rather than the individual. So that's why we have a lot of portraits in the here in the West, and a lot of their ones, especially in those olden times, have a lot of, you know, you wouldn't just have like the Damyo, for example. You would have his wife, his servants, all around the picture. It was a very interesting to touch. Anyway, back to this. It is very foggy. This is going to be a problem, in terms of fighting. Alright. Oh, I would help if I actually picked the unit, wouldn't it? Alright, Sekoku Boon, Sekoku Boon, fire bombs. We're going to try and wipe out the fire bombs as quickly as possible because of the fact that they have the fire. They've got grenades. That's really not going to help me out, you see. Alright. The enemy is bringing in the heavy boons and that down there. Okay. So, well, take the attack. And um, please feel free to attack whenever you're ready, I guess. There we go. Oh, we do. No, I didn't actually hit it. Alright, we are getting closer though. More accurate, hopefully. As I said, if I could sort of get rid of the firebomb ones, then I should be able to take out these Sogoku booms pretty easily. Concerned with hole damage. As I can get, don't let them get too close, please. So they start using their firebombs, and I don't want to spend the hassle trying to repair the ship. And come on. All right, come on. You're almost done. There we go. Wave her in. I said keep attacking, keep attacking, keep attacking. Uh, that's it, just keep... Uh, do it quickly before they start using their firebombs. That's it. Okay, take this one out. There we go. That's okay. I can take this one out then. It's quite handy the fact that they are very. They ha bleh. It's handy the fact that they're in two forces. So we do have one unit making their way up very quickly, but still, it's to our advantage. So I'm not going to complain too much. Are you actually going to move for me, please? Alright, one ship has really been jumping up in front. I'm hoping that's going to be their general, or admiral, I should say, because that would really help me out a bit. Ah, oh, come on. So I have to deal with the fact that I've got the ships in the way, which is um, stopping me from turning around properly. Because it's a sailboat, I can't just tell them to work quickly. Alright, as I continue to use the guns, 
and swing around now. And attack. Shoot. Thank you. That's pretty handy actually. They haven't got any archers on this one apart from one. Please, if you can continue to attack and to shoot that for me, please. Alright, say what, focus on that one instead if you wish. There we go, that's Raven, excellent. Alright, Fad, let's try and speed us up a bit. Alright. Well, the idea of the, these like wolves almost trying to hunt down one of the smaller ships. Alright. Tell you what, swing around. And you'll be able to take pot shots now at both sides, I think. That's it, a waver in, that's waver in. Wait, can, turn around the other way, turn around the other way. Keep him in your sights. Keep him in your sights. Right, okay, we've got one route in, great. Right, can you now destroy this one for me, please? Nope, oh well, we're going to start it. We need to start out uh, what we're going to do about these heavy boons. We don't want them entering close combat just because of how quickly they, how much troops they actually have, so. Let's bring them out. We're going to try and bring them around the side. And then they can take pot shots and then at the enemy as they go past. Alright. So when you're ready, please, me uh, men, shoot your cannons. There we go. How are they winning? Sl uh, oh, right, it's because of these. Alright. Please feel free to shoot your cannons again, please. Ah, dear me, why? Turn your ship. It is a bit thing when the AI can't even do simple things. They turn the ship around to try and attack the enemy. Alright, as they continue to turn around. As I said, take out the heavy boon. No, take out that banner. Alright, let's turn the ship around slightly. And hopefully you can start using the cans on both sides. That's it guys. It's wavering, it's wavering. Come on, take one more shot at it. Quickly. Come on, keep it in your sights, man. Shoot. Shoot. No? Okay, focus on that one instead. It's quite worrying the fact that they're not actually trying to attack me in hand-to-hand -hand combat, which as they see here, you got each of these have got 93 hand-to-hand -hand fighters. I know we've got 264, but I still reckon these will pretty much decimate me if they got me in hand-to-hand -hand combat. So it's kind of odd that they're not actually doing anything like that, they just seem to want to circle me instead. Alright, that's it. Continue to shoot. Alright, that's Routin. Excellent. Okay, take pot shots of this now, mate. Come on, it's facing you. You should be able to give it a direct broadside. Gunman ain't doing too bad against it, but come on, cannons, please. Cannons.
There we go. Alright, continue bringing the ship forward, man. And uh, this is why we try to do it by ourselves, actually by you know, ourselves controlling it rather than just letting the army do it because I reckon we wouldn't have won otherwise. And here we go, we're pretty clearly winning I would say. Surrendered. Alright, take these out men. If you please. Uh, can you not move forward? Oh no, it's because you, that's in the way. Okay, let's just turn them around instead. Uh, I'm hoping we can actually capture that, so I'm hoping the cannons aren't going to be firing too much against this. Okay, turn around instead. Let's shoot. Come on, men. Come on. Get it. Great, that's routed. Right, we got one last ship now to deal with. Turn the boat around. And concentrate fire on the medium boom, please. Come on guys, why aren't you shooting your cannons? Come on. So what? Fine. We'll just turn around, and you try and attack from the other side. This is so insistent. You don't want to use what one side. You're right. Okay. I tell you what. Quick. Prove me wrong. Okay. We managed to do some damage against it apparently because it's now which. It's, there. Let's continue to ping it around. Save Ashley. Start making your way over here. Alright, tack, 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 tack. Shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Oh, dear me. You wouldn't think it would be this difficult to try and shoot one ship, would you? Ah, uh. Christ, and now this has turned into a half an hour long, or a quarter of an hour long episode, battle just because of the fact that I haven't done this. Alright. Ship, make your way down here. Well, I'll tell you what, even if you're going to try and be a sod about it, board it if you're necessary. Keep attacking it with your guns if you particularly want to do. There we go, we've now captured it. No, we've caught it. Right, they're routing. Right, let's end the battle now. Decisive victory, no surprise there. Oh, Jesus Christ, I lost it so long. What was this? These foreign veterans damage enemy. Oh, right, this must be from the Fall of the Samurai. I haven't actually played that yet. I will be doing that in a future Let's Play, one of the factions anyway. This is a little worth listening, and in a way, the Atomo actually gave me plenty of practice for that. Alright, so we managed to capture a heavy boon as well as the two firebombs. Cool. Alright, I'm sure the Chesakabe ain't gonna be that thankful for the fact that I just saved their port from being raided. And we've got another one here to deal with. And what the... Got oh, minus one food as well. Oh dear. Ally attacked. 
Yeah, uh, we're gonna enter the war on the side of the ally. Might as well try and keep my allies as much as them as I actually do have. Oh, you tried to kill my uh, priest, you bastard. I might actually at war with Hatakayama. I have an attempt. Assassination attempt. Blockade, blockade. Enemy sh Constantly have to deal with these. Okay. How much is this going to make me do? There we go. Converted you over. Excellent. You can start heading over there next time. Uh, our ninja's been detected. Who tried to kill me? Assassination attempts. Oh, you. The super powerful ninja one. Right. Kyoto is so close, but at the same time I've got the problem. I need to... Oh, hang on. Christian buildings and... Why have we got Christian buildings nearby? Why have I got a church? Have I got a... Now let me check this map a sec. Sorry. I got that... Is there one in ta uh, Tamba? Mm, no. Sorry, I'm just curious. Why... Library? Oh, okay. That's handy enough, I guess. We can... Oh, we can't get any more of them. Why... Is it saying that I've got a Christian building somewhere in this area? Hmm. Anyway, let's... Let's do this. Alright, we can... We're gonna put the... Accept them from tax to increase their... Thing. In the meantime, let's quickly check... That's one more turn and we can actually start sorting out my food. Let's go on finance. Where am I not getting money from? Uh, you're okay. So let's put that there. Um, missionary. Okay, we need to put some units in here. So let's put two, a couple of these in there. Right, I think I should hopefully cover us now once they build them. Right. Okay, we're gonna get some gunmen in here as well, just because of handiness. Alright, it's not one of mine. Let's do the battle. Let's attack Kyoto. Alright, just double check. I reckon we could take her. Let's go. Alright. Oh, wow, actually. That's a lot of units. I'm going to need both armies, I think, to deal with this, actually. So, we're going to retreat, actually. If we can. Crap, I didn't realise I had that mu they had that much. Um, we really do need to sort out the Christianity ratings. Oh, okay, hang on. Missionary, you're my expert province person. Come over here and start ministering to the settlement. Setsu is put. Oh no, actually, let's put you in Setsu. No, stay, stay, put back in. There we go. Bang, okay, we can actually start continue to get food from them then. I mean, money, and not only that. I mean, it's an extra 500, I'm not complaining. But now it's going to be jumping up by nearly 10% every turn, so that's a handy thing indeed. Uh, what else do we need to deal with? We got Jessicabe. Right. Stop attacking my trade routes. Alright. We're probably going to lose a couple of these ships, but I don't care. Uh, we still got the, the heavy boot, and that's good. Alright, let's put you in here, and we can repair the both ships now. Alright. You, we're going to use you aggressively. We're going to attack their military port. Alright, and 
Just keep you around here just in, in to cover stuff for me. And we've got this. Alright. Okay. We've got a general here. I had another son on my way over as well. Um, all right, you're over here. You're obviously marching over slowly, but surely. My damage is personally quite honourable, but he's 61. And where is my heir, actually? Uh, nope, nope. Uh, I've got too many armies. I'm not going to do this one by one. I believe he's leading... Wakasa. No, not Wakasa. Tamba. I believe he is here. Yes, he's my heir. He's 33. He's quite loyal. Okay, let's check out diplomacy. It's sec. No, not diplomacy. Sorry. Family clan management. Alright, you're the commission for development. That's okay. You're okay. Uh, you're really loyal to me. Uh, Yoshishige has got uh, two daughters and a son. Uh, Masakata, you haven't got anyone. Hmm. You're young still. You may, you'll have time. You'll have time. Alright. Okay, let's end the turn. Uh, my armies are still continue to try and join up with the general. My, gen my other son is, is continuing his ma slow march towards the front line. This is why I've been trying to build up my sort of military buildings closer to the front line because otherwise I have to march all the way across my provinces in order to get there. And it doesn't help the fact that my sons are all going to be, you know, if, when they're born and become of age, they're going to be back at the capital, which is all the way back on Kishu Island. And there is no way, way, as far as I know, to change it. I mean, tell me, uh, tell me if I'm wrong, guys. If I is there an actual way to, you know, is there a way to change your capital, Oma? So, I mean, I wouldn't mind putting it closer to the front line if it means that I can actually get my tr my generals there quicker. All right. So these are my allies, the Yamana, the Uchi. Oh, what's they doing here? Oh, it's actually 50-50. And... Uh... Let's... Oh, it's obviously what happens. Oh, question and defeat. And I lost my trade ship. Crap. Oh, this is why you should never auto-resolve. And... Okay, so one fleet's gone. That one fleet, that did such a good job. Such a good job, and it died. Oh, now you're deciding to attack. Alright. Building a sabotage. This, this man died at the hands of an enemy agent. We must apprehend. Okay, so. Who died here? Let's have a ninja out myself. Right, let's bring them into here. Might as well hold the f hold the thing in case they decide to attack. And let's try and use the missionary. See what we can do about this ninja. Forty-three percent. Let's risk it. Conversion failed. Uh, figure that might happen. All right, let's continue to bring these guys down. It's a shame I haven't really got anyone specifically designed to convert anyone. I don't think he does, anyway. No, his main thing is province. But, uh, uh, can I pick him? Yes. 34% chance of converting him. Huh. Same I don't have another Matsuki somewhere along the line. I could actually use that. Although, one thing I need to do, we've got one extra bit of food now, and it's going to go up, I believe, to three. 
Okay, ninja, complete destroyed. Alright. We need to, what we need to do is now we will the next, actually let's modify this. Now we've got Chinito, we're going to get, it's going to be the best I think. Spear Square, the Wave of Sword and Odachi Samurai, that could be interesting. Uh, we've got Fire Arrows. Bajutsu Master thing with for the horses. Hmm. That it will be handy. Now actually let's go for the spear expertise. Why would I have the defensive line bit? So we're gonna get that. And what we need to do now is find our whereabouts. I've got you know very fertile soil. Like here, for example, so that will give me a bit more cash now. It's going to be expensive at 3,822. Let's try and find the very fertile land first, quickly. Uh, port roads, average. Ah, uh, we need to prepare this. It's a thousand, Jesus Christ. Merchant Guild, that's going to take up two food. 1,000 wealth, though. Mm. Actually, where is my most successful, most wealthy provinces? Sakushi. Let's head back over here. Let's give you, I think, the Merchant Guild. And uh, we'll use that as well. Alright. Average soil. What's next? Irami? Amiga soil. But I could get a lot of money out of you for some reason. Why is that? <laughs> Apparently, even the army. The thing is, not exactly sure why. Oh well, we will get this as well. Just so we can actually get some more money. Let's just try how we keep looking. Aki. Fertile soil. That is going to be helpful. Boost then. Average, average, very fertile soil. Alright, that's going to give me over 300 extra, so let's go for that. Alright, um, let's go to hospital going as well. Okay, I think that's enough of my money spent for the, the turn. Okay, let's end this turn again. Oh, so much for my big plan, I have to admit, to try and attack Kyoto straight away. Thing. Oh well, I'll have to save that for the next episode, I think. So, sorry about that, guys. I was I was actually hoping to... As you knew, I was hoping to actually try and capture Kyoto right now. Then have the, the first Christian Damyo. Oh well, we'll just have to do, try and work something else out. In the next episode, I think. Alright. You Siggy, what are you doing? Why are you taking so long with your turn? What? Okay, what we're going to do, I'm going to actually end the episode here, I think. Right, we'll start off the next battle, next episode, I mean, with this siege battle. Obviously, it's in my favor. I mean, not something. They got a lot of bow samurai, but we have gunmen, which are going to be quite useful in wars. We haven't got much in the way of melee troops, which we happen to have a few katana samurai, as well as that, as well as all these Ashikari, sorry, Yari Ashikaru. Which will be quite helpful. I'm not too worried about the generals because, as usual, they will wait until the end of the turn. And not only that, they've got a lot of them here. We've got their Damio, their son, and their heir, as well as the general. So that's where we're going to end the episode here, then, guys. Sorry for the fact that we didn't have much in the way of proper land battles, but 
will be taken care of soon, I promise you that. Okay, we need to secure our tech, uh, sort of, uh, thing for the Shogunate. So yes, we will be doing that, don't worry. And as usual, please, if you did like the video, then hit that like button. Uh, comments will always be appreciated. If you have any advice or any uh, hints and tips that you feel you want to share with me or anyone else watching the video, then please put them in the comments. And if you feel I am adding to your YouTube experience, then hit that subscribe button and you'll be able to keep updated with all the new episodes. Otherwise, I thank you for watching guys and shall see you next time. Bye for now.